Hello. Welcome. As you can see, we're just down here digging in the mud because we don't have anything else better to do. Just kidding. We uh, dug all this rock out. And now Leo and I are over here building this, this here wall. We found a good amount of clay. Evidently the clay is good when it sticks to you. It's not going to do it right now. <laughs> it looks good to me. And we're just jamming it in this hole. And as you can see, we're going to have to obviously test it before we drink it. But we can at least have water for washing our, our butt, our dirty butt when we're out here. <laughs> Or whatever. What do you think, Leo? You take a bath in there? No. Is it cold? Yeah. How cold? A lot of cold. A lot of colder? If a cup goes in there, it's going to be a lot of colder in there. If a what? A lot of colder in there. Mom, take a picture of me. I am. You're on the video. Show us how you do the water operation. I don't know. Tell me what you think about uh, this this watering hole. <laughs> what do you think about it? I don't know. What are we going to use it for? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> I don't know. What is it? It's a rock, rock climbing wall. <laughs> a rock climbing wall? Yeah. <laughs> and we're just going to climb it? Whenever we're, and we don't have anything to do. No. Nope. What are we gonna? Throw some mud up here. Cause there's a lot of mud. There's a lot of mud. <laughs> well, it's holding, as you can see. Here, Daddy. It's coming in pretty good. Here, Daddy. Here. We'll put a little outlet here. Right here. And I guess we'll determine how much we can collect in a matter of an hour. And then we'll find a way to get it up the hill. But this, that's a story for another day. This right here seems uh, like a success. We'll call it a success. But we'll see how far it fills up. All right, friend. Oh, hell. We're just down here exploring this creek. Found some frog eggs. Uh, and a little bit more water. I think that uh, maybe we'll get a big auger down here and drill a little bit more. Try to get some more water up in that hole up there. But as for now, we got running water. It's just a little bit, but it'll do for now. It's definitely a development. A whole web? Yeah. What do you mean? Right there. Okay, no. Yeah, okay. Alright. Okay. Well, I guess we'll get up on that tractor and start clearing a little bit of trail. Peace. <clears throat> but now, the real reason we came here today is to test this water. All right. Uh, Leo, remember I told you about pressing buttons? This dang Jeep, I can only unlock it from one side. Up there. You gonna get on it? Yeah. Oh, there you go. What? Are you taking that? Water what? first. Water first. I guess we had a visitor animal in here. Leo, you 
So we got that's a jug and some testers. But I'm thirsty. I'm a thirsty boy. You should not drink that dirty water. So it did rain a little bit, obviously. That's why uh, I got stuck in the mud. So hopefully we got a little bit more water down here. Seems like it's still holding. Maybe we got a couple critters moved in. I don't know. I said at the very least, I like to have a little critters hanging around. See if you can see any animal prints. But... Well, not yet. I guess they had to wait to tell their friends. But let me set this thing out right here. A critter. Huh? What kind? I don't know. It was so small and so fast. I guess there's a small, fast critter down here. <laughs> so this could be obviously very disappointing. But. Nice and clear. Daddy, wait for me. I want to Today we're calling the, the water down for a drug test. Daddy, wait, wait, this reminds wait. me of all my days in probation and parole. So this tests for total hardness, parts per million. Free chlorine, iron, copper, lead, nitrate, nitrite, sodium chloride, total chloride, chloride, mm. this word, something about some acid, ammonia chloride, hydrogen sulfide, total alkalinity, alkalinity carbonate. Now I might get a terrestrial parasite from this, I don't know. But. I guess I could have dipped it in the water itself. It's not drinkable. <laughs> Can you drink it? I don't know. Well, that's the game. Oh, he had it upside down. I had it upside down. So let's see here. That doesn't really matter as far as the drinkability out there. The hardness. Daddy, All right. Free chloride. None. <laughs> Iron. None. Copper. Oh, this kid. That's not drinkable, Mama. Oh, for the heck, I lost my... Oh, here we go. It's Copper. not drinkable. None. None. That Lead. Actually... None. Mom, that is actually Nitrite. Uh -oh. insect in the water. Huh? What is this? Which one? Nitrite. Hey, Mom, that's... Nitrate. Probably a lady Nitrate. Probably 5 to 50. Probably between 50 and 50. <laughs> <laughs> Nitrate. I teetered. Nitrite. Zero. Sodium chloride. Zero. Total chlorine. Zero. Chloride. Zero. Well. The acid one. Leo. Leo. I'm gonna whoop the both of y'all. Okay, Leo. These are the wildest kids take care of, okay? Leave them alone. Ammonium chloride. None. Hydrogen sulfide. None. Alkalinity. What do you think? Uh those two you have to be really fast, so it's probably zero. So it looks like it was yellowish and it's gonna turn green. Carbonate and the pH is pH. Oh. Okay, is it is it drinkable or not? Yeah. Drinkable or not? I'm calling it drinkable. Don't do it. <laughs> Stop. It doesn't test for parasites. I might get a parasite. Is it drinkable? That's the best water I ever did taste, probably. Really? Let me taste. 
Hey, look, there's a dang little animal in there. Well, I've been called crazy before. What is it? What do you think is drinkable? <laughs> test it out. I just tested it. Is it drinkable? Check it out. Is, is it drink it's drinkable? It's okay, yeah, but there's other things. Good enough for me. Now. The mom want to drink. Delilah's going in with me. I guess people used to drink out of the water all the time, out of the ground. But people done. What do you think, buddy? Huh? <laughs> well, you saw it here first. Signing off. <clears throat> All right. We dropped our last tree. And uh, got a couple things organized up here. Got our shelter up. Little pop up tent. Got our. Oh, welcome to the kitchen. The kitchen area. Of course, we got our. <clears throat> hanging pots. We've got ourselves a, a little trail down to the. To the spring. So we'll see. See how that's doing. We ran into a, a bit of a, I'm no spring uh, PhD or nothing. I'm just kind of out here winging it. <clears throat> but I kind of feel like that we've caused the spring to divert. We got ourselves a little reservoir made. Maybe, and it's holding, it's holding, but it's not overflowing, <clears throat> so I don't exactly know what that means. We have, uh, we have got water holding here, as you can see. We got our little wall. Built. It's holding. I'll turn this around. <clears throat> so I imagined it would overflow. But it's not. And it's still coming in. Right there. But I noticed that we got so now very serious flow coming out of the earth over here so I don't know that if we I mean it's kind of getting it kind of getting it now this wasn't here before this is kind of dried up, but we seem to have this coming out over here too. Pretty good. Right through here. So we seem to have <clears throat> caused some kind of <sighs> something to happen. I don't know. But we've done some really good work over here. We've, uh, oh, I got somebody coming up behind me. <clears throat> We've done some, uh, some good work here the last couple days. We are bringing the trailer in here next weekend. We got some help coming tomorrow. Uh, 
Damn, there's something else. I don't know. I can't remember. Anyway. That's about all I got, I think. But, stay tuned for the next time. Out. What's he doing over there? Are we going to chop it up? Yeah, we're going to chop it up. Yes. <coughs> we're going to push this one to this pile. Are you going like, to cut it up to like fire pieces? I don't know yet. Might need a bigger pile. You might need a bigger pile. Yeah, like, those are little pile right there, and the pile's little, and the pile over there. And those could be little piles, and then this could be a big pile if we have any big logs. What do we need big logs for, you think? Maybe our house? Yep. Or like, or like the fire, if we have a fire. The or the fire so we don't have to... Turn it up. That's right. We've got several stacks of firewood. We've got, got three stacks. Got this one is... over there, one right here, one over there, and one over there. Is this a stack and it's people on earth? You got three. Live right here in Honey Pie Holler. You got three in case Kim runs out. In case Miss Kim runs out. Yeah, we should give her some more. Because we have three. You really need all those. Share them. Share them? Are you ready to push this log? Yes. Let's get it. Alright. Alright. Another day in the bag. We're getting out of here. We got big plans for the next weekend.
Like Holy moly. Holy moly. So we got a little bit of a plan today. We got some water containers. And uh, I reckon we're going to try to get our water station set up. I got a bit of an idea. I imagine I'll fail in some way. Because I come up with this idea in my head and I don't really have a, an exact plan. But it involves pumping water out of this thing and into the tub and moving it around. We got the trailer and we got a couple of things and we're going to give it a shot. So let's see how we do. Alright, so we got our water operation hooked up. Got my trailer hitch hooked up. Got this fella right here. We're gonna proceed to phase two of water extraction. Watch your foot, brother. Phase two, driver down in there, hello. Well, we're down here. We got the generator and the Leo pump master. Pulling this water out of the spring. This little guy's working for me. Pretty decent. I guess we'll see how much we can get. It's going to be a little difficult getting out of here. 